Hey guys, Mark here, welcome back. So here in the Midwest, we are on our way to spring, which is the wet season here, uh, especially in Indiana. We have a lot of rain that comes in during the springtime. So today I wanna to talk about a pack liner. So what I like to use is what's called a contractor bag. It, all it is is a thicker trash bag. A regular trash bag is about 0.6 to 0.8 millimeters thick. A contractor bag is three millimeters thick. It's a lot stronger than just a regular trash bag that you would have. Now you can find contractor bags at almost any store, uh, Walmart, um, any grocery store will typically have them. Um, if you go to Lowe's or Home Depot, you're, you'll find them there as well, but they're gonna be a little more expensive. And you can also find these on Amazon, which I'll put a link in the description. So what's great about using a pack liner is to keep some of your items dry. For example, if you have like a down sleeping bag, a down sleeping bag takes a long time to dry out. So having a pack liner will actually help keep that down sleeping bag dry. I've also used these contractor bags as like a footprint to kind of lay all my, my gear out um, at camp to kind of get organized. I've also had to use a contractor bag as a pack cover. I have an Osprey Exos 58 and it does not come with a pack cover. So there has been issues where I've used a bag, a contractor bag to cover my pack up. I've also had to use my uh, rain jacket as well as a pack cover. So you got to kind of think outside the box if, if you didn't really prepare for rain and now rain is coming. So to use this as a pack liner, all you do is just stuff it down into your bag. Then you just stuff your gear inside of that. Then you want to give it a nice twist. And once you twist it into like a long handle, just stuff that handle down on the pack and then you can start putting your other gear on top of that. So a reason I'll carry a contractor bag to the side or even multiple is to keep camera gear or any electronics uh, dry. It's almost like an added protection. I'll just stuff everything in a contractor bag, roll it up real tight and then stuff it down in my bag. If you have heard of this before and you have a better option or a, another option that's just as good, please comment below. We're here to help people. So please, please drop your comments below. And as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Please consider liking and subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next one.